Before a busy day of activity, it's always best to walk Sophie. Although she's not a high energy dog, after a nice outing she will snooze whilst I get on with my day. The morning has started nicely with bright sunshine. Rain is forecast for later today. I'm just stopping off at a local homeware store to buy a few things. I try to make sure that everything in my home looks pleasing, even essential things like washing up tools. Here they sell my favourite wooden ones which not only look good, but also last a long time. I'm also going to restock my dinner candles as I'll be hosting a few friends soon. This shop is really interesting, they have so many different things, beautiful candles, planners, diaries and lots of kitchenware, it's a really great place to shop. It's a new hobby of mine to admire other people's gardens on my walks around town. Everyone seems to really take pride in their space. It has been so useful and given me a lot of ideas for my own garden. I'm home now and will start tidying. As I live alone, there isn't really a lot to do. I'm a fairly neat person. I like to plump the cushions and tidy things away so my mind is clear and ready for the day ahead. I got these Alstromira from the supermarket. They always last so long, especially if you regularly change the water and trim the stems. These have been sitting pretty for well over a week, and I think they have a few more days left in them. I had a friend over for dinner last night. 
I was too tired by the time he left to do the dishes, so I'm doing them now. Some people hate this task, but I actually enjoy it. My mind wanders away, and I find that the time passes quickly. I find it relaxing and therapeutic. I made a delicious chicken for dinner and a chocolate mousse for pudding. I always love having friends over in the week. I find that living in the city, people are more willing to make the effort and socialize, even after a long day of work. Tonight, I'm going for champagne and oysters with my friend Gia. I'm just home from IKEA. It's about a 30-minute drive from my house, but it's always so useful when I need to buy things for organizing. They have so many good products and clever things to make life run more smoothly. It's always a challenge not to spend too much money. I'm going to use these glass jars to store laundry powder and dishwasher tablets. I think it will be so much nicer than looking at plastic packaging every day. I need to organise some documents and papers and loved this basket weave file holder. I also couldn't resist this fern. It has such a great shape and will be perfect in my window. Now that it's getting colder, I'll be stocking up on blankets as much as possible. And I always buy a pack of paper napkins when I'm in IKEA, they are so practical. Now that we're heading towards winter, I like to make room in my wardrobe for heavier clothing. These bags are great for putting away summer clothes into storage. I buy four sets of these little hand towels every time I'm in Ikea. They are so simple and elegant. They also wash really well. I do have a little obsession with buying towels and linen. I remember that I have the perfect terracotta pot for my new fern. Once I've potted it, um, I will start to just spritz it with a little bit of water. It doesn't need watering today, but I always like to mist my plants every single day.
I change my bedding every Wednesday. Is there anything nicer than crisp, clean sheets? In the summertime, I don't really bother with a flat sheet, but now I've decided to put one back on the bed. It also makes the bed look so much neater. If you place it the wrong side up, you can fold the top edge over the duvet for a really smart look. I often sit in bed to work on the laptop, so I like a lot of squashy pillows. Since I moved into this house, I still haven't set up my TV, and I'm considering about not even bothering. I watch most things on my laptop anyway. For lunch, I'm making a tomato omelette with a simple salad. I usually make a dressing with my salads, but I recently bought some really delicious olive oil, so I'll just dress it with that. I like my lunches to be quick, easy and healthy, and I usually have soup or a salad. I always make sure that I'm stocked up on eggs. If you have nothing else, you can always whip up a good meal with eggs. It's also very handy if you have a sudden urge to bake a cake.
Well, thank you so much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed this episode. I will see you again next week, but until then, have a really great weekend and a wonderful week ahead. Bye-bye.